Right guys, here's a house tour as promised of our new house that we moved into last week in Ramsgate. So you got all the lounge and uh, the kitchen and everything out there. Let me just take you upstairs so we can see what the layout is. Right, and this is Poppy's little bedroom. Look at that. So I just bought a new bed. She's got a little unit there. A little picture. She's got a TV as well, all set up in a bedroom. So that's a nice little bedroom actually for when she stays. She's got a nice proper bed for ones and a little bedroom. Right, so here's our lovely bathroom here. Get naked, love it. <laughs> so yeah, that's our little bathroom. It's really nice actually. It's got a nice shower there as well. Oh, check that out. Look at that. Lovely modern house this is guys, definitely. So that's our number one bathroom. That's Lucy's room guys. Nice little girly room for her. Nice big windows as well. So yep, yeah, that's her bedroom. Right, and this is my bedroom, my boudoir, as they say. Not a bad sized bedroom actually. So yeah, this is my room. There's the garden outside. So yeah, that's my that's my room. Hey guys, check that out. My bed's made. Are you impressed? So yep, yeah, that is it. Alright, let's go downstairs now. Right guys, so this is downstairs. This is our lounge. The only annoying thing is that settee that I bought for the old house in Dover was a massive lounge. We lose a bit of the lounge, um, as you can see at the back. But that's where the Christmas tree's going. But yeah, it's quite a nice little cozy lounge for us. Right guys, so this is our kitchen. Let me put some lights on. Hang on a minute. So that's our lovely kitchen in here. Everything's integrated, the dishwasher, washing machine. Gives you a good look of it. Absolutely lovely in here. Look, you've got the bifolding doors, whatever they're called, that open all up, straight out into the garden. And there you go, it's a lovely size open plan kitchen. So that's what leads into this other bathroom here. Nice walk-in shower. Toilet there. Lovely bathroom. Where is it? I don't know. Oh, there you go. So yeah, that's a lovely, lovely bathroom here. Let's go and take you down into the garden. I've got my old patio set there to sit on, chill out in the sun. There's my barbecue there. Oh, we've got quite a big shed down there as well. So yeah, this is the garden. Quite a nice sized garden as well, as you can see.
Yes, a lovely place. Yes, actually a lot more moderner than the um, place in Dover. But yeah, lovely place here. Here's Marley just come in from his walk. So yeah guys, that is our house tour. As you see, it's a lovely modern place. Um, it's really nice here. We've settled in quite well already. We've been here two weeks on Tuesday. So yeah, loving it here. Lovely garden, that's the thing. I can't wait. Um, maybe next weekend, over the bank holiday, get a nice big family barbecue together. Anyway, I'm going round to my mum's house now. Um, that's William Paul has turned out to be an absolute nightmare. I've got the photographer coming in an hour to take all the pictures and then it's going to be listed on for sale next week on uh, Tuesday or Wednesday. The pool, she didn't, because she didn't use it for about two or three years or put chlorine in or any chemicals or the pumps, it's terrible. But um, hopefully you can get it sorted out, get it all done and say so get it listed next week. Now I bet you guys are wondering, what's he gonna do with the money when that's sold? Because I would be, I'd be a nosy git and be wondering. Well, financially guys, I'm looking really good at the moment. Don't even owe a penny on my credit cards. All done and dusted, gone. Which is a lovely feeling. Um, I've always had a thing that for years on end, I've always wanted a big American RV. 35 foot long plus and that's what I'm going to get with some of the money obviously I'll, I'll, a lot of it I'll put in the bank uh, but I'm looking at I don't know 50 60 grand on American RV there's a company in uh, Sittingbourne which is about an hour from us they actually import them from from America to over here so yeah I want a big American RV twin slide outs and I'm actually going to spend a few months um, touring all over Europe uh, next year so I'm thinking about going sort of um, going down to south of France into Spain into Portugal then making my way up to Italy going down sort of the coast Rimini going down to Brindisi getting on the boat to Greece but I just I've just got to get it up my sister I just fancy going in an RV and that's it so you'll be seeing lots of uh, European vlogs next year and my first time in a motorhome so yeah should be quite interesting so anyway guys I've got to go around now I'm going to sort this uh, pool out your brother's coming down on next Wednesday uh, so hopefully we can fill it up and get it all organized hey right, guys hope you're all having a good weekend and I'll catch you next week